What's up gamers? Welcome to Minimalist Video Gamer. My name is Ben. In this video, we're going to talk about a 901 multi-cart for the SNES and a Retron 2 HD that I sold. So I originally bought the Retron 2 HD as a way for my kids to share that Super Nintendo experience that I had as a kid. <laughs> they have Nintendo Switches, so that experience didn't last long. They played the Speedy Gonzalez game and a couple other Looney Tunes games, and they were quickly over it. Unfortunately, at that time, I had also ordered this 901 multi-cart off eBay. By the time the cart got to my house, they were pretty much over the Super Nintendo experience, and so was I. But I thought, I'll give it a shot. Every now and then, I'm sure it'll be fun to jump in and play some of these old games. Well, I'll be honest, the novelty wore off in about 20 or 30 minutes. The same as with my kids, I, f I realized. So as they were off with their Nintendo Switch playing their awesome games, I would pop it on and really sit here and go through the games and kind of get a hint of nostalgia for a little bit. But after that, I was kind of over it. A lot of the games are hard to play. Uh, the control's not great. And some of them are hard to look at. But overall, just when you sit there and compare it to what you have available now, I'm not trying to relive my childhood. I had a good time with the Super Nintendo. I think there was some great games. I have a lot of fond memories. And in the reality, most of them probably don't hold up. I'm sure there's quite a few that do, but in the grand scheme of 900 games, I highly doubt that 890 of them hold up. So I figured, why am I? Ha why do I have this? And that's why I decided I'll get rid of it. So for me, it just boiled down to it not being used. It was an enjoyable experience for the novelty for about half an hour. And once you get over that nostalgia, and get over the fact that, oh, wow, look at all these games. There's 900 on this one cartridge. Wow. You kind of move on and, okay, well, I'd rather turn on my Xbox. I'd rather turn on my Switch. If I still had a PS4, yeah, I'd rather turn that on. And so you kind of get over it. And I know there's a lot of collectors and a lot of retro game enthusiasts. And if that's your thing, you know, by all means, this you might enjoy this. I think it was cool. But for me, I just, I already have a Nintendo Switch. I already have an Xbox. I would much rather devote the little time that I have to gaming to one of those consoles and a modern game than to turn this on and sit here and play most of these games that I actually would enjoy, I've already played. And I think when you're purchasing something like this and even like a retro pie or an emulator or anything like that, you kind of have to ask yourself like, am I gonna really go back and play this all that often? Now I will say that if this was an emulation machine and I had like some PS2 games or Dreamcast games, you know, I think that would be worth it for me. I think that would be worth my time. It's, I mean, as far as I know right now, saying that now without having the item, I think I would like that. But I also said the same thing about the Super Nintendo and the Sega Genesis. Oh, if I had that, I bet I would like that. I bet that would be enjoyable. And in all honesty, for the 20 or 30 minutes, yeah, it was kind of cool. But the reality is it's not something that I'm going to turn on all the time. It's not something that I'm going to go back to all the time. As I said, I know there's a lot of retro gamers out there that would love this. And I think if that's your thing, cool. I think it's a cool item. I think it's a cool idea. 900 games on this little cart and you throw it in one of these knockoff consoles, you're set. Very cool. But for me, it just wasn't worth my time. Wasn't worth keeping up the space in my house. So for that, I'll just get my money back. I did sell it on eBay and pretty much recouped my loss for the most part. So, well, with that being said, thanks for watching. This is Ben with Minimalist Video Gamer.